so cute. Yeah. Ah! No. I would literally feel like a Barbie. Oh my god. I'm freaking out. Hello. Good morning. Well, technically it is good night. It's currently 10.42 p.m. But today I wanted to do a little unboxing just because I got a couple things in the mail that I'm excited about. Some things are for my cousin's bachelorette that's happening. Some things are for the kitchen, new home decor. Some is just like fun new shoes. It's a, a mix of different things. Just like a fun haul. Some things on Depop. I'm looking at it right now. I'm so excited to open it. But I hope you guys enjoy and let's get into the haul. First of all, I need scissors. Also, do you like my new filming setup? I kind of did it how I used to do it. Do you remember back in the day with my big yellow room in Canada? Like, do you remember I had the mirror in the back and like it was all yellow? But I still have to paint this side of the room. It's not completely done yet, but you can kind of see like my room in the background and the mirror. But I don't know. Let me know if you like the setup. First things first, this is the thing that I was the most excited to open. I'm so excited to show basically i went on like a little depop frenzy i found a bunch of cute things on depop i don't know what it is i told myself this year i'm like adeline you have to stop buying designer things it's just like a really bad habit and i need to stop wasting my money on designer things even though it does make me happy in the moment i feel like at the end of the day at the end of your life you're gonna regret the experiences that you didn't take and not the bags that you didn't buy so i'm trying to save up all my money so i can spend it all on traveling but i didn't make any rules about vintage designer things on depop <laughs> i found this vintage Dior bra and it's see-through. It's so cute. I don't know. I've just seen girls on TikTok and they have like their see-through Skims bras or like whatever. Here, you're going to show you like what the pattern looks like. But also, what are the odds that they have it in my exact size? Can you see it? Let me show you on the, on the titty. <laughs> but it looks like this. It says Dior on it. I wish that you could see it better. You would see it better when, when it's see-through, but it says Dior. She's like a vintage bra and I think it would be cute if I had like little pasties on i feel like i've been seeing a lot of girls especially for coachella wearing it like this they'll have pasties on and they'll wear it like this out and about and i think that it's so cute i'm like can i see through it like is it in a, like inappropriate like can i see your nipple like bing 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 bong but she's a fashion setter she's a fashion trender but she's a vibe she's a little scary you don't want to go around with grandma with only this in the pasties but at coachella at the festivals going out i think it could be a vibe but how cute is it ah! i don't know what it is i i'm a depop I was talking to Amber and she's she convinced me she was like you need to shop on Poshmark Poshmark has really good stuff and it, like, I did find a lot of good finds on Poshmark but there's something about the Depop algorithm that is just so good and it's so cute she also gave me this like pair of eyelashes which is really cute and I wasn't expecting that next up is Amazon <gasps> Baby, look at it. I got this for you. Come here. Come here. Yeah, come here. Come here. I got this for you. Don't move the camera. Oh my goodness. It's a squeaky. You hear it? Oh yeah, it's a squeaky. Stay back. I don't want to cut a whisker. Oh wait, I see it. I know. That's why I told you to come here. I know you'd be excited. One second. One second. I got a casa. What does it say? Claws. Alf Zool. It's a casa Zool dog toy and it's so cute. It basically, it's just like a really expensive tequila and like whenever you go to the bars or the clubs, like this is the most expensive tequila that you could get and it's just like bougie so that's why i thought it was so cute it was like on amazon you want to put it on your amazon storefront huh <laughs> i made a little amazon storefront thing for blue and then in here oh i saw this this is like a dupe of the um what is it called the Haley bieber kendall jenner like slicked back hair look and i think the people were saying the igk one or this one i don't know why the igk one was like i think it was like 20 bucks but this one was seven and i was like i also saw this one was trending on tiktok so i was like uh I'm just gonna get this because everyone says that this is good too, but it's just like a hair wax and it literally is just like a, a bomb for your hair. So you go, when you have your hair slicked back, you go like this and a girl on one of the trips showed me this and she like convinced me to get it. I always used to wear my hair down. I never wore my hair up until just recently this year. Like I always like, I'll put my hair in like a messy bun once in a while, but I've never like fully put in the effort, like really like slicked down on all of my hair to like make a perfect bun and it is such a vibe it's like the clean girl aesthetic <laughs> oh i showed this in my last video but i got 
two blue like what are they called it just says thank you on it <laughs> de moon wallpaper wall decal vinyl roll stick on it's basically renter friendly stick on wallpaper and i'm gonna put this on listen to this my kitchen because in my head i was like oh, i don't know if i want to do green because kendall jenner has a green kitchen and i don't know my kitchen is just brown it's just kind of boring and i wanted to spice up my apartment a little bit and we live on the beach we have a beach apartment all of my furniture out there is all blue out in the main living area so i was like we need to have a blue kitchen i'll insert photos of what is my inspo but and it was so cheap i think these were like 20 bucks each and i'm pretty sure that i can cover the whole kitchen in this we'll see the whole makeover and then boo hoo so we just to catch you guys up over two years ago my cousin asked for me to be her maid of honor in her wedding it got obviously got pushed off so many weddings got pushed off because of covid now it's finally happening and this weekend we're going on a bachelorette to vegas we're gonna see the magic mike show and everything so she has two maid of honors it's me and her friend amika and let me know if you guys want me to vlog it i feel like wedding stuff is so cute and so fun they're just like such good memories to look back on so let me know if you want to vlog it but we got a lot of things for the bride look at this i don't want to open it all yeah i don't want to open it all but look we got pajamas i don't want it to get dirty but it says bride on it and you know the pajamas that have like little fuzzies on like the sleeves and like i'll show you a picture i'll insert a photo and then we got this balloon arch it just says love future misses bride to be we want to put this in her room before she gets there so it's kind of like a tripping with tart situation i don't know i think it'd be cute bride to be we have a little sign i think that'd be cute like right above her bed but boohoo had a lot of cute like bride and even bridesmaid stuff we got our bridesmaid pajamas i don't know where i put mine oh it's over here wait wait, wait. <laughs> here we got our bridesmaid pajamas from nasty gal because i think boohoo had different colors i don't know we weren't vibing with the boohoo bridesmaid one so i got the nasty gal one they're in this pink color and i have to show you the inspo photos but we're all going to be wearing our pajamas and you know how they have like the little fuzzies it has little fuzzies like this and then we have our pajamas and we're gonna have like a wine night we're gonna have all matching i've never been a bridesmaid before i've never been like a, a part of the bride party or anything like that i've only ever been to weddings as a kid so i'm really excited this is like my first one you love your toy come here come here you love your toy i know you love it you love getting lit <laughs> okay go play with it next i'm pretty sure that this is from fanjoy yes oh my god i'm so happy i've been waiting for my samples of the i don't chase i attract merch because i only had one sample and i couldn't give it to any of my friends because i had to take photos in it and then i cut them up i cropped it and then i cropped the shorts and like now they're just like i only have the cropped version so i asked fanjoy i was like can i have some more of my own merch and they're like yes so they sent me three of my favorite the extra large i love ordering merch in an extra large and just like drowning in it oh this is like big enough for a hoodie or like a dress <laughs> Oh my god, I'm so happy. And the feeling of getting a new hoodie. I Do you guys ever see the TikToks and it's like when you get a new hoodie and you wear it for like the rest of the week? Because I swear once you put a new hoodie in the washing machine, it's just it's never the softest. It's never the same. It's not as soft. When you There's nothing like the feeling of getting a brand new hoodie. So I don't chase sidetracked. Oh my god, I'm going to wear it right now. I need to. Oh my god. I'm so happy. One thing I didn't like though about this set is that it has this kind of drawstring so i'll literally just like cut it <laughs> and then make my own drawstring like this but that's just my preference and what i like to do cozy vibes we have girls supporting girls but uh, yeah i think we got like three samples so i could give it to nikki and Andre or something excuse me can you get out the way sorry but yeah thank you fanjoy another amazon oh <laughs> i was like what did i order <laughs> basically for my podcast equipment i needed i really hope that this is the right thing but it's like a microphone what the f is this called <laughs> My brain is rendering right now. Do you see the gears turning in my head? I can't, I can't think of it. But oh, the like the aux cord, like into the machine. I don't know what the f it's called. I needed this for my podcast equipment. So finally can hear myself. I'm going to put it up there so we don't lose it. Ah! And then we got another package from Amazon. Love ordering things on Amazon and forgetting what I got. And it feels like Christmas. Oh, <laughs> this is for you too. We got so much for you. 
but I basically got Blue a brand new carrier because I just wanted a new one for traveling. Blue and I are going back to Canada for my dad's birthday. It's so crazy. My dad, my brother, and my sister, all their birthdays are like weeks apart. They're My dad's a Taurus Gemini, and my brother and sister are Geminis. We're just like an air sign family. I'm an Aquarius, and my mom's a Libra, <laughs> if you guys know anything about zodiac signs, but we're all, we're all air. So if you can imagine the chaos of that. Ooh, this is a good one. Ooh, this is a good one. This goes in the bottom. Ooh, this is for you. And it's pink, so it's so cute. But I'm super excited to see my family. I Do you guys ever feel guilty? I always feel like I never see my family enough just because I'm like here working in LA and like my family's in Toronto. And you know, my brother got to visit me. He was in LA and he has this little sneaky link. Well, not sneaky link. It's like he has a girlfriend in LA, so. He's always here now. He's always visiting Blue, but now we have a little carrier. And I'm so excited to see my family, especially for all their birthdays. My dad's birthday is May 20th. My sister's is June 3rd, and my brother's is June 10th. So it's like all in a row, and we're going to get all of them. You like this? This is for you. This is for you. Yeah, it's very good. Also, if you guys have any tips on traveling to Canada or traveling with pets, I swear they change the rules like every month or so. And I'm always stressed out that like they changed a the rule on something and like I've, I forgot to do something. But I feel like traveling to Canada isn't as bad recently because you don't really need a COVID test to get into Canada anymore. But I keep seeing all these TikToks of like the Toronto Pearson Airport and how crazy it is. So I'm nervous and I'm literally gonna show up so early for my flight because I keep seeing all these TikToks of everyone being like, oh my God, the lines were so long and I missed my flight. I had to buy a new one. I'm like, oh my God. Ah! No. Oh my God, I'm gonna get a noise complaint. Oh my God, I can't believe they sent it to me. Oh my God, Charlotte Tilbury, new Pillow Talk party. I saw this, I saw this on TikTok and everyone was talking about it. Pillow Talk, they added new stuff to their collection. Ah! <laughs> oh my God, I'm so excited. You guys know I love Pillow Talk. I love, I use their eye, their lip liner. I always use the Kylie one recently, but I it's almost the same as their Pillow Talk one. I have their, um, their blush, their everything. Oh my God, their Pillow Talk collection is the best collection. They sent over the Beauty Light one. I was gonna buy it, but it was sold out. <gasps> No, this isn't what I think it is. Is it? <gasps> oh! I feel like it. Uh, oh my god! <laughs> I'm freaking out. Oh my god, I was gonna buy this. This is the Pillow Talk um, new Beauty Light one. Do you guys remember how I was on a mission to get the Pink Gasm one? Now we finally have this one. This one is sold out for so long. I'm so excited. Thank you so much, Charlotte Silvery. I honestly, I haven't been getting excited over makeup recently, but this is like actually one thing that I'm really excited for. Then we also got the Color Chameleon Enhance Your Eye Color Sparkle. What? Pillow Talk. What is this? Color Chameleon. Oh, I think it's like an eye pencil. Ooh, come on. I feel like the whole Pillow Talk collection always sells out and it's literally liquid gold. <laughs> and then we got Pillow Talk Push Up Lashes. I've been needing a new mascara. My mascara is low-key getting a little dried out. Pillow Talk Multi Glow. Oh, this is so cute. Looks like this. Luxury Palette Pillow Talk Party for Your Eyes. Also, their packaging is just so luxurious. It looks like this. The brown eyeshadow palette. Super cute. And then Lip and Cheek Glow. Ooh. That's that's so cute. I feel like this is the sort of thing that you just kind of like keep in your purse for like touch-ups if you ever feel like your face, you know when you're like your blush like kind of fades at the end of the day, you could go like no 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 and then do your lip like and it has a mirror. Oh my god, it has a good mirror too. Ooh, the packaging is so good. Oh my god. Thank you so much, Charlotte Tilbury. I'm obsessed. Oh my god, this is all a, a girl could ever ask for is the Pillow Talk collection by Charlotte Tilbury. Oh, I could die. I could die happy. <laughs> and then next, this is the Open Farm. This isn't sponsored, but it has been the past like two vlogs. You guys know I changed Blue's food. I swear to God, Blue turned five and I instantly went into let's make sure that she lives the longest life she could possibly live mode. I literally, I was like, how is she five? I started going and saying, I was like literally researching all of the foods and everything that I should be feeding her. So I switched over her food. Right now she's eating her um, her gently cooked meals. I showed you in a, in a different vlog, but when I just have someone babysitting her or like I need someone to take care of her if I, I'm ever in a rush or I forget to like unthaw her food. I like to also just have kibble on the side, but I love Open Farm. I literally used my own code for this and I saved like, I think it was like 15 or 20%. So go to my old vlogs and <laughs> use my code and get a percent off because I love Open Farm. You love it too, huh? It's like the only food that she gets excited for. Oh! 
more little boxes. This is so cute. I went to um, the, I think it was a 626 market in Orange County and they had a bunch of foods. I did like a whole TikTok vlog on it. I've been doing TikTok vlogs recently. So if you guys aren't following me on TikTok, follow me on TikTok because I'm trying to put more effort into it. And like, I'm trying to do daily vlogs or like mini ones, but there's this company called Jibby. They're just this dog brand and they were super nice when we were talking to them and they were like, oh, we have a dog too. And I was like, oh, I just want to support you guys. I want to like buy from your brand. So I got this dog poop bag holder. <laughs> Comes with a little poop bag in it, but it comes in clutch because sometimes I won't have a poop bag when I'm walking blue and I'm like, blue, do not sh right now. Do not sh right now. You're going to embarrass me in front of everyone and I have to pick up your sh with a leaf. You know you do that. You know you do that. <laughs> so we have a little poop bag for her now. Ooh, Shiseido. Oh my gosh. Shiseido sent over their new, I don't know how to say this, Synchro Skin Self-Refreshing Tint. Ooh. And their Synchro Skin Self-Refreshing Foundation in all of these shades. Are these like samples? Ooh. This is so cute. Remember my makeup by Adeline days and I would do everyone's makeup? This would have come in handy for doing everyone's makeup. But thank you so much, Shiseido. Oh my god. Ego official. Okay, I need to show you because I... I tried it on already. That's why it's not in the box. I was too excited. Okay, so from Ego Official, they had dupes of the Valentino new platform heels. And you guys know how short I am and how obsessed I am with platform heels. Anything that has a platform, I'm already on it and I'm already wanting to add it to my shopping cart and wanting to check out. So Valentino came out with some new platform heels. You know how everyone is obsessed with the Versace ones? We do love the Versace ones. I have them in yellow, but this pink stop you couldn't get me to not get the pink so i saw ego official kind of came out with like a little dupe and it looks like this and it's so cute i would literally feel like a barbie walking around imagine like you could wear this with a nude dress you could wear this with a black dress you could wear this with a pink dress you could wear this with a white dress you could wear this with anything and i feel like this is the type of shoe that takes your outfit from zero to a hundred and i'm just so excited to wear it i think they had it in different colors i wanted to get it in nude but i don't think they it comes in nude on ego official but looks like this i'm so excited to wear it imagine Oh, I should have wore it to the pride thing today. But no, the rainbow shoes are better, but oh, I'm excited. I feel like I have a new favorite color. All my things that I'm opening. Just kidding. I still love yellow. <laughs> and then something else. I already hung it up, but do you guys remember? I don't know how long ago it was. Maybe like a year or two ago, Kylie posted in this Versace jumpsuit. And it, this is like a dupe for it. I'm obsessed because it's. I think it was like a, um, a vintage Versace outfit. And it was really hard to get. So I found this dupe and I tried it on. Oh my God. I need to send you a photo because it makes your boobs look good. It makes you look hourglass. Like the way that this cinches in right here, it makes you look hourglass. The only thing is I do wish I had a BBL to fill out the butt, but it's okay. <laughs> we have our natural butt. She's, she's, she's still there. She's not quite Kylie Jenner, but I'm super excited to wear this. I want to wear this out with some like knee high boots. Imagine with the heels. Oh my God. I'm not sure what this is. Where did I put my scissors? Oh. I don't know if you guys know Cassie Blogilates on YouTube. I did a collab with her so long back in the day, but she has the most beautiful house. She has amazing workout videos. I love her TikToks. And she has her own brand, Potflex, which is super cute. She just basically always comes up with solutions with like, you know, having your sports bra be so hard to take off after a workout. Like we've all had those like moments or like having the perfect duffel bag for the gym. Her TikToks are super cute, but oh my God, this is so cute. We have the gray, why did I say gray? We have a nude hoodie. It looks like this. Oh my god, this is gonna be so cute to work out in. And I don't know why it's been super cold recently. Every day I'm like, ooh, it's it's almost summer, springtime, time to bring out the titties. And I go outside and it's freezing, I have to cover up. So this will come in handy. And then we have the exact same in this blue color. This is super cute. I love the zip up because honestly, I do love a little titty moment while also being warm. Zip ups are the greatest if you want to have a titty moment while also staying warm. <laughs> her little card and then all about her. This is her at if you guys want to follow her. She does a lot of workout videos, but I'm obsessed with her and I love her and thank you so much Cassie Love you. And I'm so excited to wear these. These are so cozy and they're really thick. They're like really good quality <gasps> Oh my god. Oh my god. Wait a minute. Wait a a minute <gasps> do you see the inside it's like this velour it's not a regular hoodie it's like a velour type inside oh my god no wonder it felt really thick i swear her stuff is really good quality we love girls supporting girls <laughs> and then what is this did i open it upside down hi beauty we hope you're well please see the latest and newest products from artiste Ooh, never heard of them we have their skincare primer with hyaluronic acid i love me some good hyaluronic acid oh my gosh monograph powder blush duos whoa what 
Oh my god, I've definitely seen this kabuki brush before. Oh, they look so soft. <gasps> Are these brushes? They feel like brushes. Oh, I'm, I've seen these. Oh my god, I've seen these before. These are the little um, makeup brushes, kabuki brushes, so that you go like this on your face. Oh my god, I'm so excited to use these. Oh my god, it's so soft. Oh my god, this is the height of luxury. It's just going like <laughs> I don't even want to use it. I just want to pet myself with it. Oh my gosh. But thank you, Artiste. And then the last package from Amazon. Oh. <gasps> oh my god. Okay, I don't know if you guys follow this girl. Her name is Lauren Wolf on TikTok. And I met her at this Revolve event. And I remember she was the sweetest ever. She's the most extroverted bitch that you will ever meet in your entire life in the best way possible. Like, she is so extroverted and says hi to every single person. She's like that bitch. And she's super nice. I was watching one of her TikToks. She's a Sagittarius, which makes a lot of sense. But she's just like the Amazon girl. Same with Maymay. I don't know if you guys watch Maymay. But it's basically a dress. She was really skinny. I don't know if it's going to fit. And then, does it connect? Oh, right here. And it goes like this. And I thought, okay, it looks funny because I'm wearing it. <laughs> I'm wearing it over my hoodie, but it connects in the back. Okay, imagine it. Imagine I'm wearing a bathing suit at Coachella. Ooh, ooh, a little cover-up moment. I don't know. It was on her Amazon storefront, and I thought it was really cute. And I think it could be fun for vacation. You, I don't know if you guys know, but me and Brianna booked a trip to Bali, which I'm so excited for. I've never been to Bali before, but I'm a little bit nervous because it's a 24-hour flight. It's a super long flight. I was like, you know, girl, like, if you're not going to be buying designer items, like, you could treat yourself to first class guess how much first class was twenty thousand dollars yeah <laughs> it's twenty thousand dollars so yeah we're flying economy for this one <laughs> i think it was like 10 or 20 but i, I was like damn what? who buys that twenty thousand i'm pretty sure a private jet from toronto to la is twenty or thirty thousand girl got me so bent i don't know if it's just expensive though because we're traveling during like summertime when it's the most like tourists but i'm so excited for bali we're literally going i don't know i don't want to spoil it but we're going for a long time you'll see there'll be a lot of bali content and a lot of bathing suits cover-ups vacation i'm so excited oh my god i was putting away all the boxes and i realized that i forgot a couple packages and i wanted to show really quick these you almost fell off the bed. First of all, Vitae Apparel sent over a couple things. We got this pink bra with the matching leggings. And this reminds me of my first set that I got from them. It was like this emerald green set and I was obsessed. So I would wear it all the time with the matching shorts. And then this yellow set, sickening, with the matching yoga pants. But thank you, Vitae Apparel. And if you guys do want to shop on Vitae Apparel, they gave me a code. So if you want to buy anything, use the code Adeline15 if you want anything. And then I ordered this on Depop. There's this YouTuber. Her name is Janelle. And she makes her own handmade jewelry. I already opened it. It was packaged really cute. But I ordered this really pretty cross necklace. And she was so cute. She gave me an extra. I've been wearing this all all of my Instagram stories and you guys are like where is your body chain from it's from her shop it's called Lorelei you can kind of see but ah, I'm so upset I got it all tangled they're handmade and you can see that it has little like mushrooms on it it's so cute I'll untangle it soon and then 437 sent me a bathing suit I can't find it it's in my bags it's in one of my bags somewhere I can't find it for the life of me but I'll insert a photo it's just this blue bathing suit it's so beautiful and then Freck Beauty came over I don't know if you guys saw my Instagram story but they came over in this little truck and it was so cute. They gave me a little gift bag. It says Freck for this little bucket hat. Freck Beauty. Oh my god, look at this. Oh, their little tour. <gasps> all the goodies. I'm so excited because I've never tried them and I know that they're on Sephora and all the stores. This one's Cactus Water Cleansing Lactic Acid Toner. Oh my god. This bottle is so satisfying. Rich Cactus Vitamin C Moisturizer. I love how minimalist their packaging is. Their Lash Locket Liner and Mascara. Their Cleansing Gel. Four Clay Cactus Clay Mask. Oh my god, look at all of these. Slime Light Multi Mineral Hologram Highlighter. Lip and Cheek Tint. Oh my god, these are so cute. Slime Light Hologram Highlighter. So Jelly Eye Jelly. What? And then their Original Freckle. This is what's been going viral on TikTok. TikTok, it's like their freckle pen. This is her. And people will go like to get little freckles. Freck Beauty, Freck Noir, Long Wear Freckle Makeup. I think this is a different color, but woo! now that is officially everything that I got. I'm gonna put this in my jewelry organizer before it gets all tangled again. Hey. Oh, I really need to clean it out because it's getting messy. Necklace. Oh, oh no. And body chain. Ta -da. 
but I hope you guys enjoyed today's vlog. I'm gonna take off my makeup. Oh my god. Oh, the best feeling ever. Oh my god. Do you guys remember when I would do daily vlogs back in the 2018 era? I wouldn't feel satisfied until I've taken my contacts out at the end of the day on camera. That was a crazy time. And I don't know how I daily vlogged, but low-key kind of want to daily vlog. I don't know. I was thinking about it. I was like, you know what I just need? I just need to have like a routine. I feel like a lot of the times I feel like I don't know who I am. I'm like confused about what I should post or confused about what's better this or that or blah, blah 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 but at the end of the day what really got me my youtube career and like my youtube channel is just like doing it and like i'm always worried i'm like oh but what if i'm not ready what if i what if i don't do this what if i'm not good enough like blah 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 but every opportunity that i've ever gotten was because i just said it and i just did it and like prayed for the best and then it just ended up working out and like just being at the right place at the right time so part of me is like i feel like i should daily vlog whether it's on like tiktok or here or i don't know but i don't know let me know what you guys think i don't know how good it'll be for my mental health <laughs> But at least like more consistent at least like three times a week i want especially for the summer and all the traveling i love travel vlogs i've been obsessed with anna paul recently i've been like following her on tiktok and i think she's like the one that's like inspiring me because <laughs> i feel like nobody daily vlogs on youtube anymore it's so hard to daily vlog on youtube and like have mental health <laughs> and like be sane and not go crazy but at least tiktok is like you know it's kind of like instagram stories and then you voice over it at the end of the day but YouTube is just my baby. I can't I don't know. I just love YouTube But today's merch shout out of the day goes to Justine on Instagram. She's wearing the same as me It's the I don't chase I attract merch. She looks so good. Come on. Oh my god. Opposite of what we were talking about, bad mental health. <laughs> Today's tip of the day goes to, I actually found this on Instagram. And it says, good habits for mental health. Relax in a warm bath or take a shower, long shower. Be mindful about the present moment. Open up about how you feel. Try your best to get out and get 20 minutes of sunshine. Take vitamin D supplement if you don't get enough sunshine. Give yourself a break from your usual routine. Track a gratitude achievement journal and focus and work on your strengths. But I love you guys. I'll see you guys in my next daily vlog we'll see tomorrow same place same time with you guys Mwah. Mwah. Bye. Bye.